Even though many of us use the terms Wi-Fi and internet synonymously, both of them provide two different types of connections, and today we'll be discussing the differences between the two. An internet connection is provided by the modem, and usually allows you connection to one device through an ethernet cable to allow you connection to the internet service. The Wi-Fi network, however, allows multiple devices to connect through the router to gain access to the internet service, which then allows all of those devices to great, get great online content. This router can also be connected to through an ethernet cord to gain access to that local network. Though the internet connection is usually handled by a modem and the wireless and local connection is handled by the router, Quite often, manufacturers will combine these two units into an all-in-one. These all-in-one units are usually sought after because they do seem quite user-friendly, but to be honest, having them separate does allow for a customized experience that does suit more customers' needs. As there are a lot of differences between wireless routers, finding one that suits your needs can take a little bit of research. Whether it be finding one that has an app for a more user-friendly experience, has parental controls that work for your household, has better reach for larger homes, or has the ability for better diagnostics, finding a router that works for you will create a better customized experience for a better service. At start.ca, we do carry modems, but we do also have a router system that we do recommend due to its versatility. The Mercu Mesh system does allow for a powerful, user-friendly solution that does fit a wide range of households. Mesh routers can create a unique experience for customers that's not usually provided by all-in-one devices. Mesh routers do allow for the ability for multiple access points to connect together to create a net, which then allows a wider coverage for larger homes. Routers can cause a lot of connection issues, which can usually be mistaken for internet issues. This can quite commonly happen because the equipment that you have isn't best suited for its environment. Router technology has evolved a lot over the years with ever-changing needs of our customers. Because of this, certain improvements have been made with wireless technology from wireless N to wireless AC, as well as a more unique customization with the difference between a standalone router and a mesh router. Because of this, the ability to find the router that best suits your needs can be both intriguing and intimidating. The one thing we always recommend to customers when buying a router is to make sure that it has dual band technology. By having both a 2.4 and a 5 GHz network, you'll ensure that your Wi-Fi has the least amount of interference as possible. Dual band networks allow for the wireless router to send signals from two separate frequencies, the 2.4 and the 5 GHz network. As a 2.4 network can be interfered by multiple different devices such as portable phones, baby monitors, wireless USB devices, it can cause interference on that frequency, which can then cause what seems like internet connection issues. Because of this, we usually recommend utilizing the 5 GHz network as it doesn't get interfered with as often, which can allow for tasks such as live streaming and online gaming to be done wirelessly with less problems. You should also make sure that your router is rated to handle the speeds that you intend to get with your internet service. Quite often, if you have a standard router, it will only be capable of going up to 100 meg service, which is perfectly fine for most households. But for any customer that intends to get a higher speed than 100 megs, you will be required to get a gigabit router. We hope that the tips and information that we provided you in this video is enough to save you some time and energy the next time you have any issues with your modem and router. If you do find that this isn't enough to fix the issues that you've been experiencing, or would like to ask a few more questions, feel free to call our customer support representatives and they'd be more than happy to assist you. We are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week for your convenience. You can also stay up to date on the latest Start.ca news and updates by visiting our social media channels. Thanks for watching.